a little after one o'clock Saturday afternoon. Just one second. Much better now. So you're probably wondering what is Wayne doing at the office on a Saturday? And I'm gonna tell you that, but the way I wanna tell you that is by giving a quote. It's a quote that a good friend of mine named Michael Levine always says. And I'll tell you who Michael is in just a second. But first, let me give you the quote. The quote is this. Michael says that it's never been easier to succeed in America than it is today. If you'll do two things, you'll simply do what you say you're gonna do when you say you're gonna do it. That's all it takes to stand out and to succeed in the culture that we live in today in America. You see, Michael knows a lot about success. Over the course of his career, Michael's clients have included Michael Jackson, Prince, The Rolling Stones, Cameron Diaz, Charlton Heston, Barbara Streisand, and the list goes on and on and on. You see, Michael was a former Hollywood publicist. He sold his company a few years back, but during the course of his career, he worked with all of the A-list celebrities. And it's a long, long list. And Michael constantly reminds me that People who want to be successful simply need to do what they say they're gonna do when they say they're gonna do it. And that, my friends, is why I'm here at the office on a Saturday. I gave my word to some people that I would have some stuff over to them. And so I'm here on a Saturday. I may be back tomorrow afternoon as well to make sure that I live by my word. I'm gonna finish up my work here and then go check in with the family. Just made it home and the kids have their friends over so they're now eight kids here at the house playing and Heather has been out here supervising somewhat. Howdy. <laughs> I'm out here with some crazy kiddos. Um, thank you guys so much for last week's video when you commented on the birthdays. I really enjoyed looking at each one of them and I have some plans of implementing them um, on our next birthday which would be Harper's Harper birthday, yeah. So I have lots of plans for that birthday, but I have another question for you guys. I will ask you in just a little bit. First, we're gonna go clean up and get something to eat, and then I'll check that out. One of my favorite places. Not mine. I you like it. It's just very expensive for us to eat here. I'd rather go lots of other places. Forty-five dollars. Ridiculous. We got six people. Six people. To compare that, we can eat. Family of six can eat at McAllister's for thirty-three dollars, and that's everyone eating a meal on their own. True. I mean, everybody eats a meal on their own here, but. I mean, that is quite a difference, especially when you eat out on Friday and Saturday nights. It adds up. Yes, it does. Yes, it does. So just finished up eating at Schlotzky's, and let's ask Heather. So you guys, you did such a great job last time on the question. So good that I'm going to be using them in the upcoming birthday. But it also led me to another question. I have a question for you guys. I need to know chores chores what do you guys do for chores do you I mean you know you have your basics you make your bed you brush your teeth you put away your clothes and that kind of thing in the morning but do you have like daily chores or weekly chores do you do chores every single day just weekly I need to know give me some ideas as far as like more than just your basics so leave a comment below please I need to know about chores the kids are dying for them no, we are no. not. We are not. We hate them. You can just went more chores so we can do clean your whole entire house like a butler. So apparently the kids are not in favor of you leaving comments. So for that reason, leave lots of comments. Lots and lots of comments. 